Hello, welcome to today's video. We are on pages 62 and 63 of Faber's My First Piano Adventure, Lesson Book C. For today's song, we are going to be working on a new type of piano playing. This is called Mama's Bacon Apple Pie, and we're going to be playing hands together. But sometimes the hands when they play together are not going to be playing the same note. But don't worry, it's not going to be very difficult. We have some tips from Carlos, first of all. We have musical form, the shapes and the colors of these shapes. We will write whether it is section A or B or A1. We also have a retardando section over here on page number 63. Also, it says here that we are going to silently, or I suppose we'll just kind of tap the keys for um, one and two when we play together. So we're going to practice doing different fingers at the same time. Let's go ahead and listen to this piece once, and then we'll talk about how to play it. Ready? One. Two, three, four. Okay, so as you can see, the fingering is different. Well, not very much different. The fingering we're playing is an opposite or like a mirror effect of the other. Our left hand finger number three is gonna be on C. Our right hand finger number three will be on E. So whatever the right hand is doing, left hand will do a mirror effect of that. Okay, now let's go ahead and talk about the left hand first, since that's new. Okay, finger number three on C. Okay, so notice that three is on C, one is on E. Those are pretty much the only notes we're playing, except when we get over here to the retardando section. Okay, so make sure that you know where three is on C, one on E. Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four. C, C, E, E, C, C, E, two. We have two measures of rests while the right hand plays alone. Then over here on page number 63, measure five, we're gonna play it again. C, C, E, E, C, C, E, two. Okay, same thing. Right hand plays for about four measures by itself. Now this is different at the retardando section. We're gonna start with finger number four on B. Let's play the notes going up and then coming back down. Here we go. B, C, D, E, D, C, B, two. Next, C, C, E, E, C, C, E, two. Okay, and that's all we do for the left hand. Now for the right hand, what we're going to do is we're playing in the opposite direction. The left hand was moving up, and now the right hand is moving kind of down. Same rhythm though. Now let's play. As you play, 
keep your left hand in position. Let's play and say the notes for the right hand by itself. One, two, three, four. E, E, C, C, B, E, C, two, F, E, D, C, D, 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 two. Next page. E, E, C, C, E, E, C, two, F, E, D, C, D, two, C, two. Next section, measure nine. D, E, F, G, F, E, D, two. Then here comes the retardando section. D, E, F, G, F, E, D, two. We finished the same way we started. E, E, C, C, E, E, C, two. F, E, D, C, D, two, C, two. We have a little discovery thing down here. It says, which hand plays line to line skips, moving by a third, and which hand plays space to space skips? So if you look at the left hand, C, C, E, E, those are spaces, space to space skips. And in the right hand, E, E, C, C, those are line to line skips. When placing both hands together, I know the notes are different, but here is a little clue, a little helper. Okay? When you play the hands together, you're going to be playing the same finger for each hand. So instead of saying the notes, it's not possible to say two different note names at the same time. So let's say the finger number like this. Three, three, one, one, three, three, one, two. See that? You're playing the same finger, but the notes are different. Let's go on to the next measure on the right hand. F, E, D, C, D, 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 two. Next page, same thing, fingers. Three, oops, a little blurry. E, three, three, one, one, three, three, one, two. And then right hand. F, E, D, C, D, two, C, two. Here we go, right hand by itself. D, E, F, G, F, E, D, two. Okay, now this is going to be the most difficult one here. We start on four and two. Okay, so for the left hand, Practice once, and then for the right hand, practice once. Let's move it slowly, okay? Here we go. Three is the same. Four and two. One and five. Four and two. Three. And then four and two again. Two. You may have to practice that section a little bit slowly until you build it up to tempo. Thank goodness there's a retardando there. And then once again with the fingerings. Three, three, one, one, three, three, one, two. Right hand. F, E, D, C, D, two, C, two. Alrighty. So after practicing that song, let's now try it with the recording. Okay, here we go.
I can't wait either because I love apple pie, especially with the scoop of ice cream on top. That's called a la mode. What's your favorite kind of pie? So let's practice this and be prepared for next lesson. Bye-bye.